Hi, I'm Sue Hyatt with Big Purpose, Big Impact. And I am all about getting ready and passing the B impact assessment, hitting 80 points and getting certified as a B corporation. I've been kind of on the periphery of the movement for more than 10 years. And every time I go and start the B impact assessment, you know, I'm busy with a whole lot of other things, taking care of clients. Um, you know, in the old days, flying around to take care of clients, although during COVID, haven't been doing much of that, obviously. And I've had high on my list of things to do, getting B Corp certified to really document and show that I'm walking my talk about all the things related to being a better business. What's the governance structure of my company? How are we engaging in the community? How are we respecting the environment and building in sustainable practices, as well as how do we treat customers and get feedback from them and engage with them and make sure that we're helping them really achieve their outcomes. So even though I'm all about it and the companies that really matter most to me are the ones that have taken the time and made the effort to really um, wear their values on their sleeve and get external um, validation that they're doing it right. I have not taken the time to do that myself. And so my goal for 2021 has been shut up or put up, Susan, like big purpose, big impact needs because of what you do and the values you have, you need to take the time to document it, get it on paper, do the right things, get the right practices in place where they're not there now and become B Corp certified. That's what I'm up to. And what I have found out is that jumping into the deep end of the pool to do this, part of the reason I haven't done it in the past is because there's a lot to it. You have to be really thoughtful. You can't just whip through and sh put a schmear that you've got things lined up. No, it takes way more than that. So there's very few ways to find support for that. So I'm slogging through it right now myself. And once I get certified, what I want to do is help companies that are on this path and really want to do the B Corp certification and go through the B impact assessment process to help bring together communities of folks that are also on that path so that we can help each other. Like if I had had some accountability a bit earlier in the process to help me stay on track with doing it, I would not be 10 years plus in saying, oh, I need to get B Corp certified. Hmm it would already have happened. So that's what I'm up to. So I'm gonna be doing a series of videos that talk about my own process of getting through the B impact assessment where um, I have found it like some easy wins uh, based on what I'm already doing and where I know I need to raise the bar and be even more intentional and purposeful about in some other areas because they matter. And even though philosophically I agree with them, I haven't always put the uh, policies and procedures in place to make sure that those really like are there and everybody follows them and they outlive me. So I'm gonna be putting together a series of short videos with my experience and the intention here is not just here's what I'm doing, aren't I great, but it's like here's some things I've learned that hopefully will help make your path a little easier and quicker than mine. So I'll see you in future videos. Bye bye.